Yeah, New York was definitely one of the major things we started doing first. I think uh, the trip into the big city and just cruising around, you know, we saw a lot of stuff. I think uh, one of the funnier times was definitely running into Crazy H, for sure. We'll show a clip of that right now. First shall be first, first shall be last. And the brand new building already back. Some people don't know that. Where are you from? What's that? I'm from Boston. Welcome to New York. That's what we're doing. You guys understand how close Boston is to New York. Oh, yeah. I get New York, these niggas a five hour drive. Yeah. I said, what do you use, a bicycle? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he was out of his rocker. Yeah. I'll get those who come here and have no idea seven buildings are there. Fact. Nine buildings are gone. Fact. What do you mean? How big, gigantic? I think what was weird about the New York experience was definitely how new 9 11 still was and how people were reacting to it all. I mean, the ground zero was still a pit, right? And I think what was odd is that as we tried to get into places here and there, they just would not let us get in there. And I think that was definitely something that was odd that they wouldn't let us take photos or, or at least get to certain areas. So why is that? How come we can't, why is oh, no. There's right here, that's, uh, they're not uh, cements, that's the metal. Well, it's more than that. How can we, how can we just close Nobody out? How can we get, like, when we're down there, See, more we... people, you let go up here, yeah. and a lot of people are going to jump on it. These are like just... Oh, okay, I know you're saying that, alright. That's the only reason, really? And as we went through the walls and that kind of stuff, there was like this weird kind of setup where they, they really just kind of closed off like an entire area. It was kind of hard to explain. Like entire street and overpass kind of stairwells and stuff. I mean, it, it was like, it was... When they say ground zero, it was really like that. I mean, there was a lot of stuff still in shambles uh, when we went down there. I mean, they had just had fences and tarps and all kinds of stuff just covering like sides of buildings and stuff. And I think it was very, uh, you just really kind of got a sense of how crazy it was. And as we traveled down um, towards the fire station, we obviously uh, sat and listened to their stories. Uh, it was pretty tough for them to uh, and just everything. I think uh, overall, they were still pretty beat up about it, and uh, they lost a lot of people. Small planes and buildings and bodies, and just didn't think I was gonna make. So yeah, that's that's our time in New York. I think um, obviously there's just bits of this that we're showing you here, but I think uh, that was definitely a good experience with him and I. I think we had a good time, um, really just kind of getting our feet wet. If it's if it's any place to get your feet wet, it's certainly New York if you're going on a road trip, and I think we did that pretty well. So definitely stay tuned for some more clips. And uh, as I go to the footage, I'll um, make sure I get you some of the better, funnier stuff. And uh, we'll just keep going. Here we go. Tonight's the night. All right, guys. Peace.